What's up, TV fan? Welcome back to TV Nation. It's your girl, Tawana. And your boy, Vaughn. And we are back, back, back on the scene for y'all with another video. Hot Pot. Yes, and today is our viewer's choice, <laughs> Mukbang. But we have a little twist on it. Just a little twist? Just a little twist. So who shared their meal with us? It was Patricia Weathington. Thank you, for, Go ahead. thank you, Patricia, for telling us what you are eating. So we are here creating, recreating your meal today. Want to tell them so, what we got? So Patricia said she was having shrimp and broccoli that night as she was watching our video. So we doing shrimp and broccoli with a twist. Doing it in the hot pot. With some additional ingredients. <laughs> so y'all, we got shrimp. And you know every time we do the hot pot, we got to have some lamb. That thinly sliced lamb. Delish. Over on the veggie side. What we got on the veggie side? We have some bok choy. Some red potatoes. Some broccoli, of course. Mm -hmm. And some green onions. Yeah. Let's go ahead and drop the green onions because they're supposed to be for flavor. Oh, okay. Flavor. Alrighty. Let's grab a handful and put them in. I'll just... This. So y'all, this is our third time doing hot pot on the channel. Um, last time was a bit of a fail because we look at all this. What happened last? Oh, look at all this greenery, y'all. Yeah, yeah. Today you can see the greenery. Last time we had the green screen up. Not thinking. Not good. Our green, beautiful veggies look brown. Mm hmm So we had to do something about that. I'm going to go ahead and throw a couple of potatoes in here because they're going to take the longest to cook. Mm -hmm. You want me to throw a potato? Yeah. I'm going to throw three potatoes, so. And just so y'all know, I don't think we were able to show y'all the package last time, but this is the broth pack that we're using. It's by a company called Little Sheep. And it's their hot soup base. Mm. So it's spicy, y'all. Good and spicy. So I'm going to go ahead and drop me. You want some shrimp? Of course. Go ahead and drop some shrimp in there, y'all. One thing we learned about hot pot, y'all, we share this with y'all every time, is that you don't want to just overload your hot pot. We ain't making a soup. So you put your food in there as, like, whatever you want in the moment, that's what you put in there. Then you take that out, eat it, add something else. Throw some bok choy in there. Okay. That bok choy would be good in this in this. Yeah, it broth, soaks up all of that broth. All that flavor, it soaks it up. Mm -hmm. Very well, very well. And we usually get the baby bok choy. We got the full yeah, size. Yeah, we got time. the big bok choy today. Ain't no babies in here. So y'all, we sitting here waiting on Nicholas to come through. By the time y'all see this, maybe I'll put it, I'll put something up on the screen about how it went. But Nicholas, mm -hmm. tropical storm Nicholas, expected to be a hurricane by the time it makes landfall. Uh, it's Monday night for us. Mm -hmm. So um, yeah, we waiting to see what that's gonna do. A lot of the schools went ahead and announced they would not be open tomorrow. Public schools and universities, so. Houston is waiting to see. Yeah, we'll see how that goes. Hopefully everything will be okay. Y'all know how we flood out here, but we're not putting that out in the universe. We're going to get through this without any problems, without any major flooding, without any harm to any lives. Mm -hmm. Our property. Right. Where that shrimp? Well, I dig that shrimp out. Let me see if it's ready. You saw it. Uh-huh, you just had it. Stuff be swimming away, y'all. There yeah. it goes. Ooh, ooh that shrimp sure. looks so good, y'all. Oh, we need to put a broccoli in there right quick because we have to eat the shrimp and broccoli together. You can get me a little bok choy out of there. Yeah. That's the beauty of it, y'all. It don't take long. Not at all. Now some items like that, that potato, they do take. Long. That's gonna take a little long, cause it's you gotta boil a whole potato, you know. 
I can't find my shirt. I can't find it. Uh oh. Oh, that's potato. That's potato. Choy. Yes. Thank you. Put on over that for me. Mm hmm. So now I gotta let that cool off, cause y'all, when you get it out of here, you know it's really super spicy. No, I'm gonna go ahead and throw a piece of broccoli in there so I can eat it together. In the meantime, while we wait on the broccoli, so we can have shrimp and broccoli together. You want to go ahead and dip you a piece of lamb? Yeah. Now this lamb, y'all, really goes quickly. You see how thinly sliced that is? That's going to cook about 30 seconds. Definitely less than a minute. Mm -hmm. Oh, you just dip it like that? That's all I'm doing. I said, you could go and eat it like that, but I wanted to move them over. I like mine cooked a little more. You know me, I like stuff cooked, cooked, y'all. Cooked, cooked. Not overcooked. Except I do like my shrimp overcooked because I can digest it better if it's overcooked. That's cooked, y'all. You saw how little time I had it in there. Yeah. Got some red spots on it still. Oh, yeah, we got to remember we got our broccoli in here. Go ahead and get that out soon. Have y'all had hot pot before? If y'all did, put a comment section down below. Let us know what foods you put in your hot pot, what it was like for you. Yeah, this look pretty much done. I like it done, done. The goat? I mean lamb? Yeah, the lamb. Some other goat. Mm. Good, huh? And this is our favorite broth, y'all. Yes, we've tried different broths. We <clears> like <throat> really like this one. I don't know if y'all remember the last time. The last time. Give you a rock uh -oh. The last time. The broth was a Sichuan type broth. And it had what they call numbing. Here's another piece of broccoli. It was spicy. It was greasy and oily. Mm-hmm. Did we have eat the fat on there last time? Mm-hmm. <laughs> hmm. I did. Mm, that's good, y'all. I like it. So, y'all, tell me what y'all eating on today. I know y'all eating on something good. Put in the comment section down below. And as you know, we will choose from the first comment. We will, whatever you're eating, we're going to recreate that in a mukbang and eat the same thing you're eating. Mm -hmm. And today we are eating shrimp and broccoli because Patricia... Wellington mm -hmm. was the first one to come in when she was eating. So we're eating it, and it's good, girl. Thank you for that one. Good one. So speaking of that, you ready to go in on that shrimp and broccoli? Mm-hmm. We about to go in on shrimp and broccoli. We're gonna eat this piece of broccoli. Mmm. With the broccoli. Patricia, you can have the first bite. <laughs> Mmm. 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 Mm. Y'all, I bet you could drop a shoe in here and it's gonna taste good. Y'all, that broth is so freaking good. It's in that broth. Mmm. A little spicy. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, I'm gonna need to bite a shrimp. Mmm. -hmm. Give me one because I bit off mine. Right, I'm gonna get mine. I'm, I'm gonna dip mine back in there for a minute. Mm. Ready to get some more of that flavor. That's right. And like I just told y'all, I know it's weird. I like my shrimp a little overcooked, but 
helps with digestion for me. Mm, and I'm soaking up that flavor. Sometimes you gotta just eat with your fingers. <laughs> Sometimes you do. Mm -hmm. Especially that bok choy, y'all know. It's hard to eat that with utensils. Mm. Drop some more shrimp. That broccoli is everything. Mmm. <coughs> Ooh! Mm -hmm. Get you a big piece of lamb. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ooh, big lamb. Mm-hmm. Mm, so, so good. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> and y'all, eh? I love doing hot pot because this is really clean eating. We do have some noodles here, with the exception of the noodles. Everything that we're eating is just clean foods. Mm -hmm. Vegetables, meats, meats, and meats. Vegetables. that's it. But we are going to throw the noodles in there because the noodles are good, mm -hmm. good and broth. The noodles be busting, y'all. Mm -hmm. I lost my piece of lamb. Oh, that shrimp's so good. Yeah. <clears throat> it's mm. spicy, huh? It's good, y'all. <clears throat> Gotta hold on to that lamb because I will lose it. Mm. This is some good eating, y'all. Good eating, I'm telling you. You ain't tried, you better try it. Mm -hmm. So amazing. I can eat this every day. Y'all, I'm telling you, if you got an Asian store in your area, go there. They have the meats already sliced. Mm -hmm. Of course, they got a seafood section, so you can get fish. You gonna use fish? They got the they got this whole section. Some of them have some of the Asian stores, not the one we went to this time, but some of the Asian stores have like a hot pot section Dang. back by the seafood section where they got all the little. Y'all oh, remember the balls we ate the last time? Oh, yeah. That was at the other store, huh? Mm-hmm. They have all the sliced meats. They got beef, all kinds of cuts of beef. And then they got um, lamb. They got thinly sliced pork. Yeah. And we've done different types. Of, like, we've done crab. Crab is good in here. Did we mm -hmm. do lobster? I don't know if we did lobster. I don't think we did. I don't know. I don't think we did lobster. But we did crab in there, and it's it was good. Hmm. For sure. Can you drop some more bok choy? Mm -hmm. mm. Goodness. It wasn't child. It wasn't. You a biggin. You a biggin. <laughs> Big. I'm about to bust these noodles open, y'all. Bust that noodle open. Volcano chicken noodle. We just using the noodles, though. Mm -hmm. Not the sauce. Hmm? I said, yeah, just the noodles, not the um, seasoning. And you can be as creative as you want with the um, with this mm -hmm. hot pot, y'all. We've seen people use... Um, what do you call it? Seafood boil type seasoning? Oh, yeah. Oh, let me get this shrimp over there. Mm -hmm. They make their own broth. You can, Yeah, you can do that. Make your own broth however you okay. want. You got your shrimp up? No. Mm -mm. You can find it. The food can get lost in here mm -hmm. if you're not holding on to it while you dip it. it must be over here somewhere. There it is. Is it? Yeah, just grab it. That's a potato. I got it. Mm. Thanks, huh? You're welcome, dear. Mmm. Mmm. That pop choy so good. Mmm. But yeah, you can be as creative as you want to be. Mm. All your different mm -hmm. kinds of meats. 
make your own broth if you want or use one of these prepackaged broths. Mm -hmm. They got dipping sauces mm -hmm. or you can make your own dipping sauce or don't have no dipping sauce. Right. It, I know a lot of people like dipping sauce with their food, but I'm gonna be honest, this really doesn't need anything. It doesn't need any dipping sauce. If you got the right broth, you don't need nothing. But some people like to add <coughs> the extra sauce. I get it. I'm gonna tell y'all who does the best hot pots on YouTube. Well, not all of YouTube, but of the people we've watched. <laughs> Tay and Lou. <coughs> Tay and Lou are the hot pot queens, y'all. Hmm. Maybe making their own dipping sauces. Yeah, good sauces. Can get a little messy. And you have to be careful because it's like boiling hot. Okay, See? Mm -mm, he almost got me. I have burnt myself before. Let me. You gotta watch your temperature too, y'all. Mm -hmm. You don't want to keep it at a rolling boil the whole time. Mm -hmm. Dry up. You want some of this bok choy? Yeah, I'll take a little bok choy. Oof. Hot. So, y'all, it's been a crazy start. September has been interesting in Texas. Yeah. If we want to talk about, we ain't going to get into no politics, y'all, but mm -hmm. we've had three interesting political developments here, all within the same week. So constitutional carry went into effect. Now, as long as you're not forbidden to carry a firearm, like you've got, a, you know, felonies or whatever, you can carry with no license. Uh -oh. Waste. That's number one. Number two, abortions are not now illegal after six weeks. Hmm. And the third thing. It just got a little harder to vote. Oh. Ooh. It's going in that middle part. Dropping stuff? See, I'm dropping stuff, y'all. I need to go get that water. To put in that middle? Mm hmm So what y'all think about all that? Hmm. Let us know your thoughts if you'd like to. Got y'all over there. We too busy eating. Mm. Get some bok choy. Slipping and sliding all over the place. It was. Man. Ain't getting everywhere. Mm -hmm. We couldn't pick up nothing. Mm -mm. And I know I had it all over me last time. <laughs> it's been an active uh, tropical storm season, too. Is this the, this the first one we're getting, huh? Yeah. I think it's the first one that's come this way. They've had, didn't they have two go to Louisiana already? No, 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 I'm talking about Texas. Louisiana has had several. Hmm. I feel like this is the first one we're getting. Yeah. Ah! Mm, you good? Yep, I'm 
Yeah. You burned yourself? Yeah. A little on my hands. Don't be burning your little hands. I told y'all, it splashes. And I'm not careful like you careful. I'm not careful. You better be careful. I gotta be careful. Y'all, the beauty of this. We keep talking about the beauty of this. One thing is you ain't got to season nothing. You ain't got to season the meat. Mm -mm. Just throw it in there. If you ain't making your own broth, you just buy one of these packets. Throw it in there. You just take out the, you know. They have little um, packets in there with different things, just like noodles. So just throw them in the water. And then you just dip it. Shell is off, soak up some more broth. Mm, I just dip mine. You just dip it. I mean, well, that's what I do. I just dip it. I don't put it all the way in there. <laughs> I didn't know that was hot. <laughs> Smell the potato back there, huh? Yeah, I got it for Caden. Well, that can stay there for two times. Just get softer. Getting to meet some lamb right now, y'all. Kaden don't like to be beers that much anymore, so I'm sitting here. Oh, shrimp was in there. Get that lamb out of there. I'm about to. I'm sitting here, um, getting his food and taking it out. Oh, we should get him some noodles. Getting his food and taking it out. For him. Y'all will see him again when his boys are here. <laughs> oh yeah, he'll do the videos when his friends are here. Jalen, when y'all coming back, man? Mm -hmm. Jalen be watching and commenting. Mm. <clears throat> it's good. Sure. We ain't got nothing else to say, y'all, but it's good. We're just eating. That's what y'all here for, right? We just keep telling y'all how good it is. <laughs> and it's fun. It really is. Like, you're just cooking as you go at the table. <laughs> I like it. Let me put a little bok choy in there. Give me a second. I'm trying to eat a piece of noodle. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> I'll be getting it everywhere, all over my face. Mm, mm, mm. That ain't good. You got it all over your face? Yes. I don't like that. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm keep that in mind. Mm. <clears throat> How do you bite it like that? How? I can't. It's like... I just be trying and trying. <laughs> it doesn't work. I don't understand. Watch the video back. You'll see. Y'all saw me struggling with the bok choy, didn't you? I went trying to bite it. <clears throat> it wasn't happening. What happened when you tried to bite it? I couldn't. The teeth wouldn't go into it? No, it wouldn't tear all the way. Don't tear. Just put it all in your mouth. I don't put it all in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> I have a bite it. All right, y'all. We're going to keep nibbling a little bit. <clears throat> mm -hmm. But, uh, you know, y'all have probably had enough. Mm -hmm. We see y'all. If you're still here. We see y'all pushing away from the table. <laughs> y'all full, huh? Holding your bellies. Y'all full. Thank you, Patricia Weathington, for sharing your plate with us. Mm -hmm. Shrimp and broccoli. 
Good stuff. We enjoy this meal. Can you throw some more broccoli in there? You want to do broccoli for Katie? Yeah. He probably don't eat it, but uh, you want some? Mm hmm So, yeah. Thank you again, Patricia. And, y'all, we will be back with another <laughs> viewer's choice at some point. Probably next week. But, yeah. Um, thank y'all for hanging with us. If you are not already subscribed, then go ahead and hit that subscription button. Turn it from red to gray. Just to the right of that, you'll see a bell icon. Hit that. Choose all so you know when our videos come out. Thumbs up this video. Share it out if you can. And we will catch y'all on the next one. T and B Nation out. Bye.